Hey guys, and welcome to episode 10 of Lemuria. And so, yeah, off screen I defeated those white rhinos and got their uh, skin flakes. So we're gonna go bring those to the Doctor Witch. And it's white, spelled a little differently than the, the name of the color. Anyways, bring them back to the Doctor Witch. Excellent! Let me just mix these flakes and specks into a potion here, then just dump it on your head. Oh. There you go. Now, are you familiar with the concept of spirit photography? Not in the least. Good. Saves me some exposition. Basically, I need you to photomance the Malagus with this new sight I gave you. But how are we to find the fiend? It is clever enough not to return to its former nest. Oh, that is a conundrum. It is drawn to mana, its chosen diet. Where does the mana here come from? From a font beyond. Ah, curse me for a fool. Wizard, return with me to the village. I have a notion where to find the Malagast. Cool. So we're going to actually, hopefully, find and stop the Malagast in this episode. We've been kind of chasing it down for a couple episodes now. Consider a moment the Malagast, a savage beast that feeds on mana. Why attack a people starved of the stuff? Moreover, why not break into the font and gorge itself on the abundance there? Mayhap it is not as savage as it seems. Mayhap it is indeed a tamed dog, obeying the orders of a master who controls access to that font and thus its next meal. It's Lucian, isn't it? Mayhap it follows the same leader we all do. A lemur with plentiful pet peeves, who commands on threat of the Malagast. Thus, we return here. It's Lucian. If my belief is correct, Lucian must have some evidence hidden from prying eyes. Possibly even the recently evicted monster itself. But where? His cellar, I suspect. You must investigate and obtain the picture we need. I shall remain. Lest my countrymen take umbrage at my presence. Oh, so he can't go into the village, but he can be outside of the village. Okay, that makes sense. Lucian cellar. Oh, I see. It's in here. I don't see a Malagast. But perhaps these sense organs I emulate lack attunement to the correct spectrum. Try that spirit photography. Uh, so it's just photomancy. Okay. Are we just gonna... Oh. Oh, fascinating. Your photomancy now renders visible the invisible. Perhaps we should try the next room. That is a lot of ghost lemurs. Okay, and they vanished again. All right, we're gonna do this now. There's the Malagast. So it eats mana, raises the dead, can't die, destroys stars, and turns invisible? What a unique life form. Photomance it. All right. Oh, you know what? Maybe I need to get closer. Yeah, I should probably get a little closer. A very zoomed out view of it. There we go. It turned invisible again. No wonder it is so hard to find. You have what you need, though. Best return to Solomon Crane. Cool, we didn't have to fight anyone in here. That's nice. All right. Have you found the Malagast? This confirms my most dire suspicions. 
Lucian is behind this. We are not suffering the wrath of an absentee judge, but a puerile old man. I don't know what that means, but I'm guessing it's not good. We shall deal with him in due course. For now, we must return to the Doctor Witch and find the Malagast's weakness. Also, I'm about to level up again to level 144. Cool stuff. Did you keep my photo? Splendid! What? Yes, the Malagas turns invisible, don't be obtuse! Now, there, you see that? Of course you don't. But what we have here is a map of swords of the Malagas' spirit. Likes, dislikes, and what releases it. Just need a concoction of, hmm, let's see, some of this, a little of this, none of those. Definitely one of these, and that should be that. Solomon, hold out your sword. There. With that, you can release the Malagust's spirit to enter the next realm. I'll send you my bill. Well, bills. Be seated when reading them. <laughs> oh my god, she probably charges a lot. Then we've but one task with it. Confront Hierarch Lucian. When the master is imperiled, the dog will rush to his aid. Not too different than most doctors in the United States. Anywho. Um, hmm. Lucian. Let's go confront him. He's behind this whole thing. The impertinence! You dare return after your banishment? Cast no aspersions, Lucian. After all, it is not I who unleashed the Malagast. Whatever do you mean, sir? I did not unleash the Malagast! Yes, you did, sir. Run, my brothers and sisters! Run from the beast! These heathens have wrought! He flees to his home! Pursue him, wizard! Leave this demon to me. Okay, I guess we don't have to fight it again. But we probably will have to fight Lucian. He's probably in here. I don't know what school he is, but... Oh, he's Storm. Okay. Hopefully he doesn't cheat too badly. Like my pets? Uh, I learned to control them in a lost sanctum of the judge I discovered beneath the old towel. It's also where I found my manivore. An invisible monster to do all my good work. And it is good. A village needs morals. Needs discipline. Needs to not use words I dislike. These are simple people. They don't need mana. Mana corrupts, distracts, leads to the casting of vulgar spells. So my Malagast gobbles it up. As a bonus, it also frightens the misbehaviors. All in the name of peace and tranquility, and not being irksome. Yeah, this guy is kind of a tyrant. You, however, are disruptive. You enable the troublemaker Solomon Crane! You trespass where you don't belong! You are unwelcome! Okay... Oh, you know what? I should probably put in some... Oh, I already have faints in. Okay. Do I have everything I want? Okay. I have tallow shields. Okay. Okay. I feel like he might dislike this trap, this faint. No. Okay. Cool. Oh. It's blading time. I don't have any blades. I don't have any blades. Oh no! I'm sorry.
Well, if you're gonna if you're gonna use this spell, then why even tell us to blade? <laughs> It's like that water works boss where you blade and trap alternate. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Okay. Can I have a bl oh my god. My deck does not like me at all today and it's actually kind of new rule strike all your friends and you'll be rewarded. I don't have any friends. I'm soloing. <laughs> well, at least he can't hit me. That's cool. Wait, how? Excuse me, I'm on your side right now. <laughs> uh, finally a blade shows up. Okay. Alright, I'm blading like you said. Oh, he gave me a shield! That's so cute. Okay. Thank you for that, good sir. I was obedient, and I was rope-loaded. Okay, you must heal. Well... <laughs> Wait. Oh. It's over, okay. Well, if you're telling me to heal... I'm totally gonna do that. <laughs> and then I'll have to hit next or something. Yeah, I'm gonna do Freeze Ray next. Oh my god. He's giving me all these perks for obeying him. Oh. <laughs> Please don't kill me, sir. Please don't kill me. Oh, that did a lot. Okay. Oh my god. Of course it's Dear Knight. I hate that spell so much. Do I have any more blades? Yes, I do! He's gonna give me... something fun. Wait, but you told me to blade! <laughs> what? <laughs> well, at least they can't- they can't hit me now for, like, a couple rounds. So... Oh, come on. So annoying. Alright, I'm gonna hit next, for real. Well, actually, no, because I'm gonna be... Beguiled. Hopefully get another aura next. Okay. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna do another aura here. And then next round I'll hit. I should be good to hit next, so... Yeah! Cool stuff. Your healing is over. Oh my god, how are you able to... Did he just... Oh, he bladed me! That's so nice. Thank you, sir. Alright. I think I can hit. Yes. Hopefully this is a lot of damage. Yeah. 
If not, I have backup hits. But I have an extra blade on there. And that really kind rhino. I killed both of them! Sweet! Why? Why can you not understand? That was a f All I wanted was peace and quiet and for the people to never use the word societal. Was that too much to ask? Is the word societal not... Like, is that like a pet peeve? He has a lot of pet peeves. I believe he is best at wizard. Should we not check on Solomon? Alright, that was a cool battle. I liked that one. That was really, really creative use of cheats there. The beast is gone, felled by my hand. Return to your lives, all of you. The Malagast will trouble you no longer. I'm glad he was able to take care of the Malagast. Lucian's petty manipulations are revealed. You say the mana will flow freely now without the beast to consume it? Good. Then my work here is finished. I feel compelled to explore this world. There are more monsters to fight, evils to unearth. But where do I go first? Telos? You seek the darkest of the old judge's secrets and are enlisting a cadre of warriors to help you. I shall join this group then. Go, friend, and I will follow. All right, I just hit level 144. So that's cool. We're leveling up pretty fast now. So we're going to go bring that stone back to the gate in Telos. So, yeah, here we go. Wizard, may we speak? Sure. I guess. I have been pondering our latest adventure. Lucian was a bad person, was he not? Lying, manipulating his followers into obeying him? Yeah, that's that's the point. Was the old one not the same way? He abducted these people, presented himself as their founder, and twisted their hopes and destinies. More or less. In his mind. I find such pride in his machinations, and the part of me that is not him, that was sickened with the realization of what I did to him. It is likewise sickened by what he did to these people. I do not wish to be him, wizard. Oh, okay. I think, I think I tire of this shape. Proceed to the harmonic gate, wizard. Oh, so he's gonna take it on a new form now. Okay. This will do, I think. I don't know yet what I am to become. If I am to become anything at all. But I wish it to be better than the old one. Wait, but you still have his face and his head. And with this lock opened, we are a step closer to his world synthesizer. What next? You just don't have his skin. You just ha you have the shape of his head, though. Very well, wizard. Let us check in on Quartermain in his hall, then plot our next destination. Okay. Go back to the Hall of Heroes. Apparently that's what this is called. This place is called. Inside here... And up the steps. Ha ha! The wizard! You return! Your newest bird friend tells a most interesting tale. Verily, wizard, I repeated the words of the old judge's ethereal manifestation. That stallion is the template which created the heroes of this world. Indeed. Ridiculous! There is no horse stuck in my family tree. I only know that which I was told. This debate should be put on hold, good friends, for we must continue our quest for the synthesizer. And I have a clue! Ha-ha! Okay. First, what do you think, the wizard? This place is shaping up into quite the hall of heroes, oh, no? <laughs> but enough boasting. I'm the facing clue! Him. While you were away, I spoke to the hierarchs. I think one of the stations indicated on your map is in a lost region called Mandoria. It is a legend, 
No Lima has ever set paw there. But with your map, the position of the sun, and a seance or two, I think I found it! Oh, he did a seance? Oh my god. The route goes through the wildlands, the night forest, and a place called the Badlands. Don't forget to use the teleporty doodad. Off you go. Okay. Um. I think. I think that's the end of this episode. It is a rather short one. I guess we can go to the Badlands. Um. So yeah. I'll I'll walk over there and then. And then we'll end off the episode. Because if I end it now, it'll be a little too short. But yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying Lemuria. Um, it's a pretty cool world so far. Uh, there's a lot of, like, really deep lore and stuff, which I enjoy. Uh, so yeah. Oh, there's some side quests as well. That I'm not gonna do. Um, okay. Let's see. So, oh yeah, we have to go through the night forest, and then we'll be going to the Badlands. Oh, I keep forgetting about that teleporter. Oh well, it'll be fine. Yeah, that's the teleporter. Okay, but the Badlands is just through here, so... Yeah, we'll just step through. <laughs> Avoid those white rhinos. Oh. This place looks really cool. Okay. Do my keen senses detect footfalls? Quickly, you must come here. I require your aid. Duck Savage. Oh my god. That's that's a cool reference, kind of. Anyways, we're gonna go uh, continue the storyline in the next episode. Uh, when we actually head to Mandoria. And I'll see you guys in the next one. So, bye. And hope you guys have a good day. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. So, bye.